I'll show you guys with proofs and uh, just, just to be genuine and that's about it. Uh, 7 lakh 4038 views. What's up everyone? Like you guys have already seen in the title, a uh, couple of people had asked like uh, how much do you earn on YouTube and uh, what's the eligibility criteria and stuff. Again, if it's helpful for someone, I thought I might as well uh, do one. So yeah, if you want to earn in YouTube, you will have to first start off a channel. Now don't ask me how to start a channel. There are n number of videos and it's very straightforward. I mean, there's no reason to explain that and stuff. After you create a channel and upload a video is when my topic starts. So how much do I earn in YouTube and uh, what's the eligibility criteria? You guys will see all of those further into the video. There are n number of algorithms and metrics which uh, YouTube provides us. But if we narrow it down or boil it down to the main thing, it basically works on two things. One is the number of views you get and second is the number of subscribers you have. YouTube has something called as an YPP program. So it's called the YouTube Partner Program. So there'll be kind of two metrics or two checklists uh, which you'll have to fulfill. So one being the number of subscribers. So you'll have to get 1000 subscribers in the first year or in a particular year. I'll come to the year bit later. Uh, YouTube has a different sort of a calculation. And second, your channel should have been watched for 4000 hours by the public. So these two criteria are the main things to get eligible or to start earning uh, from YouTube. So coming back to the first point, I said uh, YouTube uh, works in a different kind of a year cycle. Suppose you uploaded your first video on the 1st of March 2021 and uploaded your second video on the 15th of March 2021. So YouTube calculates from 15th of March 2021 till the 15th of March 2022. So likewise it keeps on going. So it's not like uh, from a particular date to a particular date. It's like from this date what you're seeing until the same date in the next year. So that's how YouTube calculation works. So suppose you clear the YPP program, you have a thousand subscribers and people have watched your channel for more than 4,000 hours. Once you're eligible, you'll have to go through a certain checklist. It will keep on sending you emails or to set up an AdSense account or to upload your bank details, to upload your bank information. So as and when it comes, you'll have to keep on doing that. The ads will start uh, playing on your channel. That's how revenue generates. Coming to the bit of how much I've earned until now, how much money I'm being paid per lakh views or uh, per 10,000 views or per 1,000 views, uh, you guys will see it now. I'll show you guys with proofs and uh, j just to be genuine and that's about it. Off to the laptop. Suppose this is your YouTube homepage. So you'll have to click on the top uh, right hand corner and go to YouTube studio. Anything and everything related to YouTube, uh, your analytics, your revenue, you should go to YouTube studio. If you want to see the revenue generated or uh, anything and everything related to your videos, the number of views, watch time hours, you should go to analytics. And once you get in here, so this is how it will show. Since I'm particularly talking about the revenue bit, so here you'll have to so here you will get the option of uh, if it's the last 7 days, if it's 28 days, last 90 days, last 365 days. So I will check the last 365 days. So in the last 365 days, I have got uh, 7,4038 views. Total watch time is 22,000 hours. I have gained uh, 8,000 plus subscribers and this is the main bit. See, this is the estimated revenue. Uh, for the entire year which I've got 9,751 rupees. So if I narrow it down for the last uh, 28 days See this is the amount which has been generated and if you want to see how much uh, money I've got per video or uh, per uh, 10,000 views suppose from August 15 till now how much revenue I've got this video has uh, done around 41,000 uh, views and uh, for 41,000 views, I've got triple uh, six reach, the engagement, the audience. Uh, there's a lot many things you can look into. Likewise, if I come down, uh, per 1,000 views, if you calculate, uh, so this video has done around 1,335 views. Let's see how much money I've got for that many views. <laughs> I've got 20 rupees uh, for 1,300 views. So this is how YouTube works for uh, let's say around uh, 
10,000 views. Let's check uh, any video which has close to 10,000. Yeah, this has done uh, 9,140. I'll show you guys. This is generated <laughs> 186 rupees. So like you guys saw, YouTube India pays very less. Uh, just around 200 odd rupees for almost 10,000 views. It's just like peanuts. Heck, you can't even get a kilo of peanuts, I believe, for the amount which you get per 10,000 views. If you want to make YouTube your main source of income, you should at least uh, upload around 20 to 25 videos in a month. And each of those videos should at least garner around 7 to 8 lakh views. That's when you might feel at least a considerable source of income. So if you're not getting that sort of a viewership or that sort of an audience, uh, it's my advice to young uh, content creators or young people who want to make uh, YouTube their full-time career. So until and unless you reach that point, uh, you will always have to have an alternate source of income. Don't completely kind of depend on YouTube until and unless you get that sort of a viewership until now at least. Yeah, that's about it. I hope you guys like this video. Please do subscribe to my channel, like this video and uh, watch my other videos as well. And uh, until next time, goodbye.